on. Well, I always told Willie I'm going to come back and lay on the floor again. Back on Willie. Fisherman Willie from uh, Madras, you know. Uh, let Willie say what he got to say in the old little old word. Last time we see him, he's talking about all kinds of issues, but he can't get out of the country, you know. But he, but he said exactly what he wants to say. But uh, we got to talk about some more stuff to get out of the country. I want to talk about. What do you think about the crime situation now? How 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 the progressive liberal political party use the crime issue to get them votes inside inside parliament? The use the crime issue now. You go on to 101. Uh, what wait, wait, 106? Anyway, it, it's over 100 right now. What do you think now? Very Christian strategy is bring this crime down. Right today, five star one employment. Where there is no work, everything created from that that is evil. Because number one, man need to feed his family. And when you take the man of this country and lock them up into prison, what you want happen to their wives and their children? How do you want these? single family to feed their children after putting a man into the prison cell which is the slave plantation it would be very great if the Bahamas government would teach in the school what slavery is all about slavery is when a man have no right over his culture and want to learn and they want to teach him a strange culture. For instance, before they teach of our ancestors, they're teaching us about John Kuno. I'm not saying John Kuno is not good as some sort of what would they call uh, something to relax and enjoy. Because they, 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 they have some great stars and, and really professional. When you come to black people, the behavior have some special ones. Because if you check it out, even to the Olympics, they stand up with countries that have up to 50 million people doing very well. So, what is going on in our country here? It is very great that the government would take to an understanding that when they put these men in jail, send the welfare to their house to take care of them people, children. Even the little girls, like in 15, 16, they have to go seek for food to feed their daddy in prison. If you take the leader out of the house, or take the shepherd away from the sheep, what you want to happen to the sheep? Or what you want to happen to the people living in the house? They must all suffer and deteriorate in any form or fashion. If there is no prime minister, the House of Assembly will be fighting all day and all night. The only little good they got in there, because they got a man who they say is crying over everyone. So when you look into a man's house or into a family, the, 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 the male factor is the prime minister. He's the one who has to prepare everything for his house. Well, it's better than these said we got because it's a big guy ain't looking in over there. Tell me about that. I, I put a poll up on, on my website uh, talking about Loretta Butler Turner. You think she'll be a better uh, leader than you with Minutes? Well, uh, I will not want to emphasize to put woman in charge because God said that they're supposed to be behind. A woman now was made to be a leader. I didn't even have any question I asked you now. But just I asked you then, do you think she'll be a better leader than you would be us? Well, I can say because when all of them try to be leader, they be good. And after they get in there, they change. Okay, they, okay, 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 tell me so. We are in the British system. Who was the Iron Lady? Margaret Thatcher, right? Right, sir. Okay, yes, okay. sir. I agree. Great Britain. Right. Strong, powerful.
for woman, yeah. for all woman. Inside there, did what they had to do, and you know what I mean. They did what they had to do. You know what I mean. What they did what they had to do. All right. So I said, I said, you know, I just, I just, I just throw it out there, put the poll up. I just trying to figure out because the only voice right now, who in the House of Assembly right now, under the, under the, under the, underneath the Free National Movement party, look like they get some real, real serious, serious balls. Yeah, I, I she's she's acting pretty well, but every woman has their place in the home. I understand that. She cannot take the fa the husband's or the king's job. It can't be like British. Try, I ain't trying to get it to be the, the queen and the king, you know. I'm just saying we can do a poll. I just ask you your opinion because see, when I do the poll, I can let you know the I can let you know the, I can let you know what the behavior people say, that's what I say, or what you say. Because when the poll go up, and people that vote, then I come back and say, really, guess what? On my website, I put a poll up. And this is what the behavior people say, that me, not you. Will you say what I say you have no relevance to what she can do? Or what the behavior people would say? Because you know and I know. In this country called the Bahamas, if someone don't like you, they don't vote for you. Yeah, but those, all of those things have to be changed as people get educated. Yeah, but guess what? In the Bahamas, boy, if they don't like you, they don't vote for you. You forget when Kendall G. L. Isaac was the leader of the Free National Movement, he never sit down inside the Prime Minister seat. Why? Because the behavior people did not, they didn't, they didn't say they didn't respect him. They know he was a qualified man. They respected him, but they didn't like him as a leader. And when they don't like somebody as a leader, people will vote for them. And so far, 
people like you but menace is a man, but they don't like him as a leader. Mr. Minutes, I have I, I haven't find anything wrong about you. I don't minutes. find nothing wrong with I, myself. I feel I like talk about what the people I'm saying because that's what when you have polls, right? What I say it and what you say it have no bearing on what the people say. When you put a polls, that's why you put a polls, you know, so you can see exactly what the public them saying. So, so when I put up a poll and said, anyway, you know, maybe around February or so, I say, listen, I can put up a poll and say, we think Ross and Vinny's be making sense. When they come back to you and say, Vinny, the people in the Bahamas say, but you make very sense. The people in the Bahamas say, you're talking about the craziness. Well, everyone has the reason to make their own decisions. As I say now. But when you come to a leadership, the foundation was laid by the Almighty God, and it cannot be changed. So God say he put man as leader. You see how a woman brings sin into the world because Adam didn't sin, Eve fall into the transgression of sin because she take over her uh, uh, king's throne. And she, you see what happened to us today. By the spell of our eyebrow, we now have the bread because of the wickedness of our mother. She allowed herself to be placed in the wrong place at the wrong time. I am not a man who believes that woman should be ahead uh, in the house, neither in, no, in no houses, okay? Neither in church, because the Bible also speaks about the churches and the woman. Say, so let a woman keep silent in the house of God. And if she line up something, wait until she go home and discuss it with her king or her husband or her priest or her prophet. She should not be altering her ways in the, top of, in the house of God. God didn't call them to do that. God called them as a help for a man, not to be alongside the man 50, 50. And women today believe that they have the same right as a man have. And that is the reason why you have so much children without father. Because a woman feels like she could go out there, become a school teacher, and get any job in this country, and have a baby while she employed for the government, or for people, which is wrong. She's supposed to have respect for the job and what she's doing. I don't feel like we in this country should have a woman prime minister. I don't think so. I am 100% bitterly against that. Because why? If a woman leading you and you was man, how could you be man anymore? You was a woman man, not God man. If you was a God man, then you would be the leader. And if you was a woman man, she would be leading you. I, this, this girl that we're speaking about, uh, Mrs. Butler, she's a very intelligent woman. I love her because of her aggressiveness and how she gets things done. But, no woman should be called a minister because that is not a minister. That is not a woman's job. Minister means man, not woman. So you got to put things where belong in the churches, in the house, in the parliament. Come on, man. We need them. They are good helps. You can't do it all of them. I love them, but at the same time, they must know their rightful place. Why is that when these women run the house, you know? They have to run the house because the man refused to put on the pants. <laughs> there are some women, thank God for these women who had good fathers. Because if a woman have good, had a good father, she will, uh, she will have some of the father's genes. But if she don't have a good father, a mother, a woman alone cannot raise up no children, especially a male child. So a woman should not have the prerogative of raising up a male child. It's wrong, because the, because the man was first, and the woman is second. So she should raise girl children and let the father raise the male. Okay, it's a sin for a woman to go having children and she ain't got no man to take care of them what she's doing to the country. She's destroying herself and the country.